So in this video, we're going to solve log base 5 of x plus log base 5 of x take away 7 is equal to log base 5 of 2 plus 2 log base 5 of 3. Now let's focus our attention on the left-hand side. 5 is the base of both those logarithms, so we can use the product rule to bring them together. So we can write that as log base 5 of x times x take away 7. Now the right hand side, the 2 can be brought up to the power here, and so we would have log base 5 of 3 squared, which is 9. And then I can use the product rule to bring those two together. So we would have log base 5 of 2 times r3 squared, so 9. So we have on the left hand side log base 5 of x squared take away 7x. And on the right hand side we have log base 5 of 18. Now, if log base 5 of something is log base 5 of something else, those two somethings will have to be the same. Essentially, um, we're used to logging both sides. In this case, we are fiving both sides, if you like. Um, essentially, uh, I'm going to be doing 5 to the power of log base 5 of x squared take away 7x is equal to 5 to the power of log base 5 of 18. Because essentially I'm using an inverse function here, um, and 5 to the power of log base 5 of x squared take away 7x is just x squared take away 7x. And <clears throat> 5 to the power of log base 5 of 18 is just 18. Okay, so that's what's going on behind the scenes. So now I can subtract 18 from both sides. And we have a quadratic to solve. Now that factorises to x take away 9, x plus 2 equals 0. So x equals 9, we'll solve that bracket, equals 0. Or x is equal to negative 2. Now, the thing with logarithmic equations is you've got to be very careful to check that the solutions you get at the end work in the original equation. Now, x equals 9 is perfectly fine. If you substitute x is 9 into this, you'd have log base 5 of 9 plus log base 5 of 9 take away 7, so log base 5 of 2, okay? And it all works neatly. So x equals 9 is fine. But x equals minus 2 is not fine, because log base 5 of minus 2 is undefined, okay, for real values, for real numbers. So this is not a solution. Log base 5 of minus 2 is undefined uh, for real values. So x equals 9 is the only real solution to my original equation. So you've got to be very careful and always double check that your answers work in the original problem.